I'm looking for the Bucks in an upset without Paul George in the lineup. Mm, okay, I see you calling the game right there. Speaking of calling the game, we will send it out right now. They've made some subtle changes throughout their kind of attack, and they are starting to take shape. Whistle foul will go on Lopez as he climbs the back of Marcus Morris. If he does put it down with his left hand, he pulls back to his right. So maybe we'll see the Clippers eventually start coming from that blind side when he drives left, anticipating the spin. They shot 68% in the first quarter. Lopez into the paint, leaves it short. He takes more threes on the season than he does shots. That means they have five on four numbers. Clippers have outscored the Bucks 17 to 6 here in this second quarter. On Giannis. Lopez comfortable from above the arc, but misses everything, and it goes out of bounds, and it goes back to the Clippers. To the basket. Giannis collides with Zoo, slings it out to Lopez. Good looking three, and he knocks it in. 68 64. I always love the injury where they limp back defensively, come back the other way, and throw it down. Here's Leonard at the foul line. Morris, good look at a three. Flatlines it. Zoo tries to keep it alive. Bucks control down six. 99 88, Clippers out in front. Giannis plays catch with Lopez. Settles for the jumper and knocks it in. Man finds a seam, drives on Lopez. May have been blocked. Loose ball recovered by the Bucks. Lob inside to Zoo. Tough grab. He makes it anyway. Tries to get back to Man. Double ball fake. Stymied by Lopez. First nine years of his career in Brooklyn has reinvented himself over the last few years. And that's what. Mike Budenholzer was talking about in the press conference before the game that we had to build this team. The two saw what Kawhi had done in the first half with two offensive boards, putbacks. He just took a page out of his book. <laughs> Lopez back the other way.